Philippine Arnis team exemplified excellence in martial arts by surpassing its expectations of winning 12 gold medals. Our national team garnered 14 gold medals, not 20, was which was what I said earlier. It's 14 gold medals, six silver medals, and two bronze medals for a total of 22 in the three-day event. The Philippines won five gold medals in the first day, followed by a dominating seven gold medals yesterday. And today, our Arnis athletes capped off their campaign with two more gold medals and four more silver medals. And that's why joining us today on the score is the victorious coach of our Philippine Arnis team, Coach RJ Garcia. He joins us live on the line. Coach RJ, good evening. Hi, good evening, good evening. Coach RJ, first of all, congratulations. I mean, how, how proud are you of the SEA uh, Games campaign of your, uh, of your Arnis athletes? Oh, we are. The entire coaching staff can never, can't be prouder. Uh, we are very happy that we expect uh, we exceeded uh, all expectations. Uh, I'm very thankful. Actually, our head coach is uh, Mr. Richard Dialogo. I am the strength and conditioning coach. So yeah, we're very very uh, uh, happy and uh, more uh, beyond uh, pleased with uh, how the games transpired. All right, and just curious, Coach, um, you said that you had a goal of 12 gold medals. What did this tally come from? Yes, uh, well, basically, uh, there's no magic to it. We just focused and stuck to our plan. Uh, the, from the planning, the preparation, uh, six months ago, uh, more than six months ago, and then the actual training from the conditioning to the skills training, uh, we all just... Uh, kept our nose on the grinder. Uh, we made sure that our athletes didn't get distracted. Uh, yeah, and then we just kept going until it's, it was time to uh, tone down the training, have them focus on recovery. And then now they're 100, uh, come game day, they're 100% prepared. Co Coach RJ, uh, you know, yeah. one of the talk of uh, social media was the intensity of our niece videos. Mm -hmm. Kasi pinaparad nila mga clips of you mga gold medal finishes natin, mga laban natin. And people were so amazed with the intensity of Arnis uh, matches. Are, are you not happy that more and more people are getting excited for Arnis in the Philippines? Oh, super. Uh, yung we, we've been talking about it. Uh, na, yun nga eh. It's like, it's just um, that time has come na ano, uh, Arnis... Uh, is getting this kind of uh, traction and uh, attention. Yung the training and the, even the program from a few years ago, uh, the, our athletes have been uh, practicing Arnis since they were young, in grade 6, high school. So they've been practicing for anywhere from 6 to 12, 13 years already. Uh, and yun nga, sakto na now they're at the age where at the prime of their training where they can really showcase their talent. And I love what you said, um, Coach. You said the time has come for the rise of Arnis. So to those who are not so familiar with Arnis, I know this is the first time that Arnis is in the SEA Games. What specific skill set do you need in a martial art like this? Sorry, sorry, uh, come again, sorry. What skill sets do you need for Arnis? What skill set? Yes. Oh, um... Of course, you'll need the training uh, of the martial art and the sport. Um, but for in, for actual uh, physical skills, it would be a lot of coordination uh, and stamina, um, and uh, to, so, so that you can control your body um, for the duration of the match. Uh, but beyond that, also um, a lot of focus, a lot of. Uh, drive because of course uh, to be able to reach uh, higher levels you have to train very hard. Coach RJ, uh, here's your opportunity to thank all the people, the groups, all the Filipinos who supported the Arnis team in all your victories here in the Southeast Asian Games. Okay, uh, well, too, much, too many to mention. Uh, on number one, I'd like to thank uh, Senator Miguel Zubiri, our uh, the president of the Filipinas Krimakali Arnis Federation. Um, they've been giving like 200% support. Uh, wala akong masabi. Uh, of course,
course to our head coach, Sir Richard Dialogo. Um, really, uh, he likes to stay behind the scenes, pero uh, talaga, if you ask someone uh, who is involved in sport earnings, talaga, ano, he gets everything done for us. Uh, every, and all uh, people who supported our athletes, the uh, parents, the coaches in their own local clubs, and everyone who gave their support online, uh, our athletes, grabe, hindi makatulog sa pagtitingin ng ano, <laughs> social media nila. Uh, yung iba nga talaga, we had to, ano, uh, we had to control them. Uy, may laban pa kayo buka. So, they're very excited, very thankful. Uh, overwhelmed talaga with the support of all the Filipino people. So, everybody out there, really, thank you very much. All right, well, maraming maraming salamat, Coach RJ, and thank you once again for uh, calling attention to the National Martial Art of the Philippines.